Detroit police looking for these two men, wanted for shooting into a group of infants, killing one of them. Detroit police are looking for Jose Jackson and Christopher Long Jr. Both men are wanted in connection with that shooting that happened this afternoon on Winthrop Street near Seven Mile and Greenfield on Detroit's west side. Mara McDonald is live at the scene, and Mara, we know the children were actually right there on the front lawn. Sandra, they were. The kids were out here, all babies, on the front lawn with a 24 year old man. Out here, you had an 11 month old, a four month old, and then you had six month old Miracle Murray. We've got a picture of her right here. When the f shooting started, poor little six month old Miracle was hit, and she wouldn't survive. The aftermath of what happened out here is heartbreaking. That six month old was hit in a spray of gunfire and died en route to the hospital. The 24 year old man out on the front lawn with her and the 11 month old and a four month old was hit. He's expected to survive. Somehow the other two babies weren't hit. As if this couldn't get any worse, it does. The chief filling us in. We also believe that this tragic shooting incident is connected to the tragic shooting incident involving a three-year-old on Easter Sunday. Yes, the same crew wanted for killing a three-year-old child on Easter Sunday is responsible for this. There is a gang nexus. We believe that these individuals are connected to a local street gang. We don't know what the dispute totally is over, but we know enough to know that these three suspects are connected to this shooting today. Police say a late model silver Saturn SUV with Christopher Long behind the wheel and Jose Jackson in the front passenger seat, along with a third man who has not yet been ID'd in the back seat, drove around the block twice. At one point, that unidentified man in the back seat got out, went across the street and hid, and then opened fire into the group of babies on the front lawn. Christopher Long Jr., Jose Jackson, let's not be a coward now. Turn yourself in so we can take you into custody. Because we are going to find you. That's our promise. Back here live, Detroit police have squads all over the city looking for these two right now. And they're in the process of trying to ID that third man who was in the back seat. Steve Sandra, we're live on the west side. Back to you. And Mara, any description at all from police on that suspected shooter? <laughs> Yeah, and but it's minimal. I mean, right now they're telling us they think he's short, that he's between like 5'1 and 5'5, five, five, early 20s. Uh, he was wearing a black and white sweater, black pants. Uh, I think that they have a handle on who this is, Sandra, and I think it is only a matter of time before they release a pick and an ID. Back to you. All right, let's hope some folks come forward with some information. Thank you so much, Mara. Here is another look at two of the three men police are now searching for in connection with the shooting. Take a good look. 24 year old. Jose Jackson and Christopher Long Jr. Police tell us the two men are armed and extremely dangerous. If you have any information at all about either one of these two men, call Detroit Police right away.